Hi guys and welcome back to another plan with me and congratulations to Risha Ahmed that won the 1k subscriber giveaway yay so I'm just gonna show you a little footage how I came about to her name it's just literally randomly picked by random.org so this is literally four minutes after the giveaway had ended I went to random.org And here is the Excel sheet of everybody's name that entered into the giveaway. So thank you, thank you so much everybody for entering. I so appreciate it. I think it was over 400 of you guys compared to my first giveaway which was only less than 100. Here I am just scrolling up through all your names. There was 431 entry. I made sure that nobody entered twice. So I went back to random.org. Um, minimum is one and maximum number is 431. And I'm just gonna press generate. number 76 so I went back to the list and scrolled for number 76 and there you go Risha is the winner of our giveaway yay so thank you guys for entering the giveaway I truly appreciate it and leaving comments too. Like all your ideas or themes were so amazing. I was so impressed and inspired by all your comments. So thank you guys. Okay, so let's get back to this week's plan with me. And it's a holiday theme, which I love holiday themes. So it's Mother's Day weekend. The Sunday is a Mother's Day. And I'm going to use my Heart of Gold kit. It's super simple colors white and gold and pink those are my favorite colors so that's what I'm going to use for this holiday theme not to mention it's going to be a no white space spread another reason why I decided to use this kit is because I found these Mambi stickers at Michael's for Mother's Day and I just love the color with the gold the white the black the pink so I think it will match my kit very well so the inspiration for this kit was actually for Mother's Day and I thought that you know what what is more pure than your love for your child or the appreciation for your mother and both appreciation and love is just so pure and honest and I figured oh my gosh it's just like gold pure gold so that's how it came about so you see here is actually my main monthly spread I will have the video linked down below in the description box if you haven't seen and this was last week's spread, which I did not film, I'm sorry. But however, this kit was actually part of my May Mystery Mock-Up Kit. Now, this May Mystery Kit is not for sale at all. I just made one mock-up mock-up, as in it's only an example to show you what my future mystery kit is going to be. If you guys want to get your hands on this May Mystery Mock-Up Kit, just combo me on my Etsy store and I could do a custom listing for you. However, it's only for the Happy Planner. I have not made an Erin Condren version because as I said before, it's a mock-up and I just made it for my Happy Planner and that's it. So it's only available for Happy Planners. Okay, so this week we're planning May 2nd to May 8th. Let's get started. Because it's a no white space spread this week, I'm going to start laying my bottom washi down and then work on my sidebar. And usually my to-do section is at the bottom 
of the page. So I'm going to lay down my ombre hot check boxes. And I always want to show you guys my to-do headers. It's always embellished with something because I just love the little detail it adds in your spread. And when you have it down in a row, it just looks like it's a washi tape too. Next that's done, I'm going to work on my midsection, which is usually my full boxes. I decided to put the quote sticker on Sunday because that's Mother's Day. And then the rest, I'm just going to balance the color out for the whole week. So next is my washi tape. I already picked a few out for this spread. It was pretty easy because literally it's just three colors, white, gold, and pink. I usually lay down my selection and play the process of elimination and I think this time I just eliminated the one. So I know that I wanted a layered style washi for the midsection. So here I am just placing the diagonal gold foil washi down first before I put the sparkly literally gold washi. Can I tell you this is my favorite washi and I'm almost out of it. I'm so sad. But I don't really remember where I got it. I think I got it at Michael's during the Christmas time so they don't carry it anymore. And I'm going to finish that top header with my top washi that comes in the kit. Once all that's done, I'm going to work on my today's section, which is usually at the top part of the page. And I put down my meal plan stickers all in a row first because I have to plan my meals every day and it's usually dinners that I have to plan. Because lunchtime, me and my kids, we eat leftovers. I didn't realize that the camera battery died at the beginning. <laughs> Because when I realized that it died was when I finished doing Wednesday. So I didn't know it got cut off at actually the beginning of Monday. So it's a typical day of the every day of the week is almost the same for us. It's all very routine and schedule because you know when you have kids you have to be on a certain routine or a certain schedule. As you can see here, this wash is just get to glitter everywhere. Anyways, on Thursday we have a play date with my niece and her kids to play with my little ones. Just gonna indicate that with two little teddy bears. Well, it's a teddy bear and a sharky. Stuffed sharky. But anyways, also my husband has hockey that night, so I'm just gonna put down a quarter box with a hockey sticker. So Friday, my daughter has school slash daycare. I put a quarter box with a little girl sticker. Now, a lot of you guys ask me where I got these little girl stickers. I actually, they're my stickers, and I just customized it to how my little girl looks like. Like, she, my little girl has long brown black hair, so I just made that, made her look like that. Um, if you guys are interested, I could put a listing on my Etsy page. Just let me know. But I wasn't sure if there would be a huge demand for it. Now on to the weekend. Now because it's a no white space spread, I'm going to cover the top parts with this gold foil washi. Oh and some of you guys were asking about my jewelry. Um, the gold bracelet you always see me wear actually is from Savarsky. Savarsky, yes. And the rings that you see that I have on my fingers is usually from H&M or Forever 21. I'm going to cover the bottom weekend header with one of my blanks header. We are heading out on a trip that day, Saturday, so I just put a little checkbox list there just to make sure that I have everything that I need to bring with me. Alright, I have to apologize that the pages is actually out of frame because editing this was Oh my gosh, pulling hair and teeth because I 
didn't know it was out of frame, so I apologize if you guys couldn't see what's going on at the bottom and it's not a complete look. Okay, once that's done, I think I'm going to add my Mambi stickers on. But then I realized before I want to put the decorative sticker on, I want to work on the bottom washi, which you guys can see. See how frustrated I am right now? But yes, I wanted to add a little bit more detail to the bottom washi um, with one of my pink washi. As you can see it there, I just put it down. So for those of you who don't like to waste, because I hate wasting my washi tape because they're pretty expensive here in Canada and stuff like that. If I have extra like that, I would grab an extra gift card, not extra gift card, but a used gift card. So I'm just going to show you here. Here's a Starbucks card that I've used. There's no money value in that, but I thought the card was pretty. So I'm just going to use, take up the washi tape here and just wrap it around that card. So now I'm just putting the pink washi down at the bottom of the washi. Once that's done, I'm just going to wrap my unused washi on my card. So now I'm going to use my Mambi Mother's Day sticker and I'm just going to decorate my spread with this. Time you guys are watching this, I am actually on vacation now and am sitting in the hotel business center editing. So I apologize if you hear any kind of background noise because there are people here too. I'm just picking out the color pens I'm going to use. I think I'm going to do the pink because it stands out a bit more. I didn't want to use black because I could have used black, but I kind of want a bit more color for the spread because it's Mother's Day. Because it's a Mother's Day week spread, I'm going to create a memory card. So here's a really old picture of my mom and I. And I'm going to use my Polaroid zip to print out a picture from my phone. Because I too am a mother and this week is all about celebrating mothers. The scrapbook paper I'm using is from the Minds I call Fancy That Say Chic. And I picked out this pink and gold foil because it matches the spread. I'm going to tape down the pictures. All the materials I've used for this video, I'll just list it in the description box down below. With the washi tape, I'm going to recreate what or recreate the layers that I've used in my spread just to match it. And I'm going to decorate it again with the same Mambi's Mother Day stickers. I'm just going to trim the card with this scissor trimmer. It's a scallop edge trimmer. Now that I'm done, I'm just going to mark the holes and punch it out with my hole puncher and cut out the slit so it could sit in my happy planner. guys missed out at the beginning of this video this was my last week spread that I did not do a plan with me video on because I was actually testing out my May mystery kits and its format and its layout and as you could see on the left side of the page that's my May monthly spread which the link for that video is actually in the description box and here's my favorite part is to put down this week's spread I am absolutely in love with this week's spray, not to mention they are my top three favorite color, white, gold, and pink. And Mambi did a very good job with their Mother's Day sticker set. Usually with a memory card like this at the back, you could jot down your notes, you could also add some more pictures or anything you like to it, but I just want to do one side this time. Thank you guys for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. 
um, if you like to receive more videos like this please subscribe and turn on your notifications so YouTube will let you know when I'll be uploading a plan with me video I hope this video will give you guys some idea what you could use your planner I sometimes use my planner as a memory keeper too on certain specific days or holidays or days that are dear to my heart so thank you guys again and thank you for watching happy mother's day to all mummies out there or moms to be and i'll see you guys next week happy planning bye